that. <laughs> Glory to God. God is good. And all the time, God is truly good. Amen. We have much to thank the Lord for. Amen. Much, much, much to thank the Lord for. Amen. What a wonderful thing to be a child of God. He said that he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. My God, under the shadow of the Almighty. Is anybody from Jamaica in here? Raise your hand. All right, some Jamaicans in here. Glory to God. That the mother hen with her chicks, when she see the mongoose coming, she spread her wings and pull her chicks under the shadow of the hen. My God, and that mongoose can't touch them chicks. Mother said, you got to pass through me. Lord have mercy. And sometimes mother hen just rail up and fight and fight and fight. And then chicks stay under there. I don't know how she's so skilled. I don't ever see a mother hen fighting for her children. None of them chicks come from underneath her. She stood over them and she fight, fight, fight till brother mongoose have to go back in the wall, have to retreat. No surrender. So the Bible said, he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. We thank God. Amen. How many thank God today? Praise God. Hallelujah. My God, I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress. A refuge is a hiding place, a place of hiding, place of rescue. My God, the Lord is our refuge. Israel have seven refuge city. Now when the enemy come against them and they run to the refuge city, they are exempt from everything. You can't even arrest them if they kill a man. My God. But thank God. God bless you, sir. We have an exempt covenant. Come on, let's give the Lord a praise for that covenant. My God, they say there's another virus. Amen. Releasing the earth called the monkey virus. But thank God, we are sons of God. We are not monkeys, so we just claim exemption. A monkey virus coming to none of the church people. Lord, have mercy. Come on. Somebody ought to clap your hands and give the Lord a praise for that. My God, God is good. We bless God today. Well, Dana, you ready? Thank God for everyone this morning. Those of you in the hospital at home, amen. Wherever you are, in your car, in your business place, Amen. Wherever you are in the sanctuary, wherever you are this morning, grace and peace be unto you from God the Father and our Lord Jesus Christ. This is a special day. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. So I want you to do something this morning. Clap your hands and give the Lord a praise for the day. Oh, oh my God, something good is going to happen to you today. Oh, I, wait, I expect something good. Come on. Because expectation is the womb for manifestation. Come on, come on. How many expect something good to happen to you today? My God, we thank the Lord today. Amen. A day we have never seen before. Amen. We thank God for you. Amen. The tune in live and Facebook. Amen. Welcome all the viewers. Amen. Across the nations of the world. As far as to Nairobi, Africa. England, Canada, Jamaica. My God, thank God for Zoom. <laughs> My God, thank God for technology. I dare you clap your hands in the sanctuary and give God a praise. Amen. Under your mouth. Scoop in your mouth and say, Lord, I thank you. Come on, let your voice be heard. The devil is afraid of your voice. Your voice is the voice of God's authority in the earth. Come on, come on. Somebody ought to give God the praise. Amen. Don't die. Don't die in silence. Open him out. Give him a praise. What a mighty God. We magnify him. We glorify him. He's a wonder. Come on. You've got much to tell. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, I dear somebody else stand up and give him a thanks in here. Glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Could have been dead, but we're still here. Could have been in the hospital, but we're still here. Could have been crippled in a wheelchair, but we're still here. Oh, could be on the respiratory system, but thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. It's not all. We don't have it all that we desire to have, but thank God for life. Oh, glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. 
Somebody ought to tell the Lord, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't know what you come here to do this morning, but I come to praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. My God, my God, my God, my God. Somebody say he's a wonder to my soul. Glory to God, glory to God, glory to God, glory to God. Oh, give thanks unto the Lord, for he is good and his mercies endure it forever. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Angels can say so. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so, whom he hath redeemed from the hands of the enemy. Ah, oh, God, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The price has been paid and the battle is already won. What a mighty God. What, what, what a mighty God we serve. Oh, nobody can do you like Jesus, Father God. Hey, nobody can touch you like the Lord. Nobody, nobody, nobody can do you like Jesus. Somebody ought to praise him right where you are. The survivors, the overcomers. My God, the power shifters. We thank God today. We thank God. We thank God. My God, my God, my God. I feel something is about to happen in here. I feel something is about to happen in here. Glory to God. I came expecting something to happen. My God, Father God, in the name of Jesus. We thank you this morning, O oh God, for your grace. We thank you for hearing the righteous when they call. We thank you for setting the godly apart for yourself. We thank you, Lord God, because you have granted unto us all things that pertain to life. God, I thank you because we are a royal priesthood. We are a chosen generation. We are a peculiar people. Father, we thank you because you made us different. Lord, we thank you, God, because you supplied our every need according to your riches in glory. By Christ Jesus, we thank you, Lord, because we are a product of your imagination. We thank you, Father God, because we are ambassadors in the earth. We thank you, Lord God, because you lift us high, 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 higher, higher, higher. You lift us up, O oh God. And Father God, somebody came here this morning because they have a need. Lord God, they need a breakthrough. They need a touch from you. They need a miracle. Father God, in the name of Jesus. God, somebody came here this morning because they need a word from you, a fresh word. A word that will turn their circumstances and their situation around. Father, bless your people today. Have your way, God. We come against every foreign spirit, every diabolical spirit, every strange spirit, every vagabond anointing. We mashed it up this morning in the name of Jesus. We pulled down every stronghold, every satanic sabotage, every satanic resistance. Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ, let your fire fall in this house today. Send, O oh God, the fire of the Holy Ghost. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, God, help us to grab back, O oh God, to reach out and touch you today. For only one way we can touch you, just believe when we call on your name. Lord God, we bring this house under order right now. We bring it under apostolic order. We release apostolic grace and apostolic anointing in this house. We arrest the arrester, every strange foreign spirit. We lift the embargo. We lift the restrictions and the house. God, let healing take place. Let miracles take place. Let manifestation take place. In the name of Jesus, send a fresh anointing that makes preaching easy. Oh God, that makes worship easy. Oh God, in the name of Jesus Christ, don't let us leave the same way we came. We come to receive from you. We come to give you something. Aye, for nothing is, oh God, permitted to leave heaven until something leave the earth. We come to set up a praise to you, Lord. And when we set up, oh God, send down your anointing. In the name of Jesus. 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 Oh, we gather together in your name this morning. For you say we're two or three are gathered together in your name. You say there am I in the midst. Lord God, we bind up every contrary spirit. The only spirit welcome here this morning is the spirit of God. We arrest every foreign spirit. We pull down every stronghold, every barrier. We demoralize them. We devalue them. We release them out of this house. We cast them out. Oh God, fill somebody with the Holy Ghost today. Oh God, send an anointing in this house. Oh God, let the glory rise. Let the glory rise. Let the glory rise. God, send a fresh oil in this house. Anoint the preacher with a fresh oil, a fresh anointing. In the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. 
Thank you for our hands that still work in God. We can clap our hands and give your praise. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, let everybody say amen. Come on, put a praise on it now. Hallelujah. Come on. Clap your hands. Let the devil know I've got the victory. Hey, 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 hey. Come on. Clap your hands. I let the devil know I got the victory. Your mouth know you have it, but let your hands know you got it. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 I say your mouth know you have the victory. Let your hands know you got it. Let your hands know you got it. Rock your body. Let your body know I got the victory. I've got a victory. I got it. Oh, yes, sir. I'm not fighting for it. I got it. Hallelujah. Woo, shaya, yes, sir. My, my, my. God is a good God. How many know that God is in the house? Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Come on. God is. He's already. Can't you feel it? Present. He's already. Come on, church. All you have to do is open up your heart for God. He's already. Come on, let's sing it again. Oh, God. He's already. Oh, can't you feel? He's already. All you have to do is open up your heart for God. He already. Come on, church, sing it again. Say, God is already. Oh, can't you feel it? He's already. All you have to do is open up your heart for God. He's already here. Come on, one more time. Everybody say, God is He is already here. Oh, can't you feel His presence? He's already you have to do is open up your heart. Come on, say that again. Say, all you have to do is open up your heart. Come on, say, all you have to do is open up your heart. Amen. He's already here. How many come to give God praise this morning? I come to give him praise because he's worthy of my praise. There's a song that says, Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Come on, everybody say, Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. You, Lord. Come on, say it again. Great are you, Lord. Great are you. Good. 
Great are you, Lord. Come on, church, sing it. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Come on, say it again. Great. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Oh, great are you, Lord. Come on, sing it. Great are you, Lord. Great. One more time. Shh. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Say it one more time. Great. Can I hear everybody sing that? Come on. Great are you, Lord. Come on, everybody say it. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Sing it one more time. Great are you, Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Come on, give him praise. He's worthy. We're talking about a great God who deserves to be praised. Amen. We're going to ask our... Amen. Our Ella Swaby to prepare a scripture reading for us this morning. Amen. Shout to the Lord, all the earth, let us see power and man. Pray to the King, mountains bow down and the sea. Everybody, let's sing it together. Shout to the Lord, say, shout to the Lord, oh, oh the earth, let us see power, majesty, power.
nothing compares, nothing compares to the promise I have in you. Can we sing it one more time? Come on, everybody, lift your voice and say, Shout to the Lord of the earth. Let us see power, majesty, power. Of your name, of your name, of your name. I sing for joy, I sing for joy at the words of your hand. Forever I love you, forever I love you, forever. Nothing compares, nothing compares to the Nothing compares, nothing compares to the promise I have. Nothing, nothing compares to the promise I have in you. Can we sing it one more time? Shout to the Lord, shout to the Lord. All the earth, let us see power, majesty, power and majesty. Praise to the King. Mountains bow down. Mountains bow down. And the sea will roar at the sound. Everybody say, nothing compares to the promise. Say, nothing to the promise. I said, nothing compares. God has God cast away people. 
God forbid. For I also am an Israelite of the seed of Abraham, of the tribe of Benjamin. Lord, they have killed thy prophets and dig down thine altars, and I am left alone, and they seek my life. Even so then, at this present time also, there is a remnant according to the election of grace. then Israel hath not obtained that which he seeketh for, but the election hath obtained it, and the rest were blinded. And David said, Let their table be made in a snare, and their trap and a stumbling block, and a recompense unto them. I say then, have they stumbled, that they should not, they should fall? God forbid. But rather, through their fall, salvation is come unto the Gentiles, for to provoke them to jealousy. Read together, for I speak to the Gentiles, insomuch as I am the apostle of the Gentiles, I magnify my office. We thank God for the reading of his word. Come on, give the Lord another praise, amen. amen. Praise the Lord, amen, amen. How great is our God, sing with me, how great is our God, oh see how great, how great is our God, come on everybody say, how great is our God, sing with me, how great. Everybody, how great, how great is our God. Sing with me, how great is our God. Oh, see how great, how great is our God. Come on, say it again. How great, how great is our God. Sing with me, how great is our God. Oh, see how great, 
one more time. You're a name above all names. You're a name, name above all names. And you're worthy. You're worthy of all praise. And my heart will sing. My heart will sing. My heart will sing. My heart will sing. How My heart will sing. My heart will sing. How great is our God. Come on, give him praise. Come on, he's worthy of the praise. Song says, I don't know why Jesus loves me. I don't know why he cares. I don't know why he sacrificed his life. Oh, I'm glad. So glad. Come on, let's say that again. I don't know why. I don't know why. Jesus loves me. Somebody tell me. I don't know why. He cares. I don't know why. I don't know why. He sacrificed his life. Whoa. So glad he did. Somebody said, where would I be? Where would I be if Jesus didn't love me? Think about it, church. Where would I be? Where would I be if he didn't care? I might have been dead, but where would I be? Where would I be if he didn't sacrifice his life? Oh, but I'm glad, so glad, so glad he did. Can we sing that verse again? Where would I be? Where would I be if Jesus didn't love me? Tell me where would I be? Where would I be if he didn't care? Tell me where would I be? Oh, if he didn't sacrifice his life, oh, but I'm glad, so glad he did. Come on, one more time. I don't know why. I don't know why Jesus loved me. I don't know why. I don't know why, I don't know why, he sacrificed his life, oh, but I'm glad, say it again, say it again, oh, oh, but I'm glad, come on, say it like you mean it, oh, but I'm glad, so glad he did, hallelujah, come on, he, I'm so glad. Hallelujah. And what he done for me. It's so amazing. The love he has. I cannot explain. All I know. All I know. What he's done for me. Come on, somebody say, Amazing love. Amazing love. Amazing love. Amazing love. Come on, it was amazing love. Amazing love. Come on, one more 
one more time. What he done for me is so amazing. Come on, church, sing it. The love he has I cannot explain. I cannot explain. All I know is I once was a law. All I know is now I'm found. I was blind. And I know he'll do for you what he's done. Come on, lift them hands and say, amazing love, amazing love. Come on, church. Amazing love. Come on, Pat. Amazing. Come on, lift up both those hands and say, amazing all I know is I once was no but now I'm found. I was blind, but now I see. And I know He'll do for you what He's done for me. And I know. Come on, say it again, like you really mean it. Say, I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. Yes, I do. I worship and I know. Come on, say it one more time like you really mean it. I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. I worship and adore you. I worship and adore you. Just want to tell you that I love you. I just want to say, I just want to say that I love you more than anything. I just want to say, I just want to say that I love you more than anything. We're going to sing it one more time as Apostle Smith come. Everybody, I love you, Jesus. One more time. I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. I worship and adore you. I worship and adore you. Just want to tell you. Just want to tell you. That I love you. That I love you. More than anything. I just want to say. I just want to say that I love you more than me. I tell you, I tell you. Now why don't you tell him? Come on, he's been telling you all along. So why don't you tell him this morning? Come on, tell him, tell him, tell him, tell him. 
Come on, I didn't say clap your hands. Tell him I love you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Uh, nobody can love you like Jesus. Come on, tell him you love him. My, my, my. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We love him more than anything. What a mighty God. He deserves our love, don't it? I say he deserves our love. Amen. I would have the nerve to say we got to love him back. Because love is not a one way aside, it's not a one sided affair. He's always showing us that he loves us. Somebody lift your hands and say, I love you, Jesus. Woo! My God, didn't that feel good this morning? Tell, tell Jesus you love him. My God. Every now and then you just have to tell him, I love you, Jesus. More than anything. You may be seated, please. We honor the Lord this morning and we thank God. Amen, because God is so good to us. Amen. I don't know about you, but God has been so good to me. Amen. And I'm grateful just to be alive today. Yeah. Amen. To stand on my grave. Yeah. Glory to God. I told them this morning, the last news over a million and a half. Amen. Didn't make it through the virus. But thank God, look at me sitting in the house of the Lord this Sunday morning. Telling Jesus, I love you, Jesus, more than anything. My God, we lost some saints, some good saints. Amen. About five of my friends who were pastors and bishops didn't make it through. But thank God. Amen. I am still here. I believe that God is up to something. Oh, come on. You need to say, Lord, I don't know what you're up to with me, but I know you're up to something. So say like Jeremiah, here am I, Lord. Send me, good God Almighty, God is good. I am grateful this morning to be in the house of the Lord. It's truly an honor to have all the saints of God, amen, in the house of the Lord this week. This week we didn't have to attend a homegoing service or a funeral service for any of the saints. God has been good, amen. I say God has been good, amen. We made it through another week and we thank God, amen. So many crazy things is happening in our world. Amen. But we thank God that we have a covenant of exemption. Amen. That we can claim, we can walk in the power and the glory of God. Because he is a keeper. He's our shield, our butler. He's a friend that stick it closer than the brother. He give us security, y'all. Amen. And we thank God. To the point that the Bible said he give his angels charge over us. It's a militant word. It means he give his angels charge. Mean responsibility. Take care of him. Watch over them. Don't let no demons in hell cut them off prematurely. How many thank God for that? Don't let them die in their sleep. Huh. Hold them up, let them dash their foot against the stone. How many glad that angels is assigned to protect you? My God, my God, and God is still deploying angels today to work for the saints because they are ministering spirit to those who are sanctified. They are heaven enforcers that bring out God's bidding in the earth and behalf of the child of God. You got angel working for you. Good God Almighty. Oh, my God, my God, my God. I say you got angels working for you. Jesus had angels working for him because he was the son of God. And we are the son of God too. So we have angels working for us. My God, I thank God for my angel. God is good. All right, we thank God for presiding Bishop, Bishop Barney Brown. Come on, give the Lord a praise for the man of God. Let's all stand and give the Lord a praise for the man of God. And his beautiful wife, Lady Gail Brown, grace and peace be unto them today. We celebrate life. Amen. We thank God. We thank God. Amen. We are on the preacher's time. You may be seated, please. We thank God for Pastor Miranda, who's with us this morning. God bless you, woman of God. Grace and peace be unto you. Amen. All the saints of God, we have some special guests this morning, and this is the only church in the world that you come as a guest and you leave as a family member. Amen. So one time you come and we welcome you. The next time you're a family member. So if we did not welcome you the second time, remember, we don't welcome family more than one time. Am I talking? Glory to God. So we're glad to have you this morning. Amen. Feel free to dance. Clap your hands. Praise the Lord. Run over the church. If you got the Holy Ghost, if you're running, keep your eyes open. Amen. Because we don't want any accident. And you might not have an insurance policy on your life. But we have somebody here today who's a licensed insurance saleswoman. Amen. And if you don't have an insurance family plan, you can see. Amen. Missionary stand up. Missionary Avery Simmons is a licensed. Amen. Insurance saleswoman. 
Amen. So those of you that don't have no insurance in your life or you're planning to change insurance because they're charging you too much money, you can see her. Amen. And if you're on Facebook, you can call her at 347-452-8682. Amen. We thank God. We got to support our own. Nobody not saying anything. Glory to God. Amen. So to God is good. We also thank the Lord. Amen. For Celine Michelle. Amen. Who's with us. Amen. And her aunt. Amen. Oh, no, Celine and Michelle. Amen. From Jamaica, Bishop Jackson, stand up please. Let's give the Lord a praise for them. God bless you. Welcome to the triumphant church of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name. Well, God is good. Somebody, let us all stand. Give the Lord a praise. Amen. Put your hands together tonight. Tonight, 630, triumphant church of Jesus Christ in Myanmar, Florida. They're having a special combined men's service. And they're inviting all the men who are here and everyone, amen, combined with Jamaica and other churches, amen, that's 730. And it's the same Zoom number we use all the time, Eagles, at Wednesday nights, 480-503-7492. Can't miss it, got to be there, amen, 730. Grace and peace be unto everyone. Come on, will you put your hands together, amen, as we turn over the service into the hand of this man of God today. It's a pleasure, it's an honor, amen, to present to some, introduce to others, the presiding bishop of the triumphant church of Jesus Christ worldwide. Will you put your hands together and receive the pastor, Bishop Barney Brown? Come on, give the Lord a praise. Somebody shout, bless him, Lord. Come on. Amen, God bless you. Praise the Lord. Come on, let's give Jesus another great big hand of praise. He's our guest of honor the Lord Jesus Christ and we thank him and we give him praise this uh, 22nd day of the month of May we want to wish all of you that have a birthday this month a very happy prosperous healthy um, birthday praise the Lord amen and we thank God for you today you may be seated in the presence of the Lord amen we thank God amen for you in the house of the Lord today praise the Lord and uh, we're looking for some more of the saints to come back out, but every time we think we're getting close, then New York have another spike. Amen. And I'm getting nervous now because some people, I don't know if they're coming back. <laughs> I'm, I'm worried. Hallelujah. I'm praying for them. Amen. They've been gone too long. Praise the Lord. But we're thanking God for you that are still here. And I think... Uh, I think I got to treat you good because you might lead me too. Praise the Lord. <laughs> I better treat you real good. Praise the Lord. But God is good and we thank God for all of you that are here this morning. And today is our Youth Sunday. Amen. Praise the Lord. And amen. Uh, some of our youth are not here. Praise the Lord. But praise the Lord. You that are here, that you are young at heart. Amen. We induct you into the honorary. <laughs> you are honorary uh, youth. Praise the Lord. Amen. Somebody put your hand on your heart and say, I still think I'm a youth. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Didn't the Bible say that even the youth shall faint? Yeah. But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. Praise the Lord. Amen. And we thank God for that today. Um, my sister, amen, Wanda, Pastor Wanda Miranda is here this morning. Praise the Lord. And I would like her to say something. Praise the Lord. She lives in Thomasville, Georgia. And trust me, that's way, that's deep <laughs> in the south. <laughs> we was driving to our house. We passed um, these houses that look like. You see them in the movies, like um, plantation. plantation houses. I was like, where on earth am I? Praise the Lord. Oh, I see cotton fields, and we arguing, is that cotton? No, that can't be cotton. That's yellow. Cotton is white. And they said, oh, cotton is yellow until it blooms, and it ripens, and then it turns white. Old as we were, we didn't know that. Amen. 
But she's here this morning. Praise the Lord. And I'd like her to come and say a hello. Because, amen, she come to visit me. I don't go visit her too often. Praise the Lord. I went for her 60th, I think, birthday banquet. Praise the Lord. And I haven't been back. Praise the Lord. <laughs> and I'm not going by myself. And after past 9 o'clock, I ain't going nowhere out at night. They ain't got no street lights either. <laughs> it was so dark when I went there last time. I said, y'all don't have street lights? They said, we got one way down there. I said, my Lord, I'm staying inside. Praise the Lord. I, I ain't used to the country life. Praise the Lord. But God is good, and she's here with us this morning. Amen. And we're going to ask her to come and, hallelujah, say something to our youth. Amen. And If we have enough time, I would like Sister Dana to come and say something. I was saying, Sister Dana is too young, too beautiful, too talented to be in the back booth. We want to see you in the front. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. So let's receive our Pastor Wanda Miranda, and then we're going to have our Sister Dana. You could bring your mic, Sister Dana. Working pretty good. Praise the Lord, everyone. We have come through. Hallelujah. We're still going through. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. But I want to give thanks, hallelujah, to the leaders. Hallelujah. My brother, Pat, Bishop, Dr. Money, bro. You know me. I'm not good in that formality. But praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I esteem them. Hallelujah. For working. Hallelujah. Also, Apostle Smith and his wife. Hallelujah. Lady Gail, I'm thanking you also. Hallelujah. For what y'all doing, hallelujah. Sometimes it seems like nothing is going on, but there's water moving, hallelujah. And it's the spirit of the living God, hallelujah. He's moving in everyone that allows him to just push you through. Hallelujah, glory to God. Oh, Father, tell people, you know what? The spirit doesn't stop. It's always moving. Yes. You want to jump in? Come on, jump in. Hallelujah, he's going to take you through. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. But not taking too long and also... Saluting every one of you, old, young, hallelujah, in between, hallelujah. God bless you, hallelujah. I'm so thankful to be among my brothers. I got these brothers, hallelujah. I got to come back, hallelujah. And when he's playing that music, hallelujah, I just want to get up and dance, hallelujah. Why? Because the Lord has been so good to me, hallelujah. He has brought me through things that I thought I couldn't go through, hallelujah. So I give him the glory, hallelujah. Praise the Lord for those young people that are here, hallelujah. Those young people, hallelujah, they will hear the word of God one day, hallelujah. We pray, hallelujah, that they will get passion for the Lord, hallelujah. Yeah. There will be those balls of fire that the Lord say, hallelujah, that we are, hallelujah, flames of fire, hallelujah. When Jesus comes back, the angels, hallelujah, will be flames of fire, hallelujah. That's what the word says, hallelujah. In John 14, hallelujah, glory 6, hallelujah. It says, and Jesus said unto him, I am the way. There's nowhere else to go, hallelujah. We must go in that way, hallelujah, glory God. He said, I'm the way, the truth, and the life. We got everything there, hallelujah. And they said, no one can go to the Father except through Jesus Christ. We have religion that's trying to go through. They're trying to go over and under, but God say, hallelujah. I sent my son to be that way, the only way. Yeah. I don't care what other thing they're teaching. The Bible talks also in Luke, I think it's five, five hallelujah. He's talking about, hallelujah, the, the way he called the disciples. He called them from something that they really knew to do, hallelujah. Especially Simon, hallelujah. But one day Simon found himself, hallelujah, in a place that he, hallelujah, quite went out fishing and no fish. Mm. He got ready, he put everything Back together and the day is finished. We didn't get anything. Hallelujah. But he heard the voice of one. Hallelujah. Who came out. Hallelujah. They throw that thing back in. Hallelujah. Throw that net. And what happened? Yeah. They obeyed that voice. You 
it is very important to obey the voice of God. Because sometimes when you're walking in your strength, hallelujah, it seems like you can't go no further. But the Lord himself, hallelujah, will tell you, let your let, hallelujah. And that faith, hallelujah, you will see the miracles that God's going to bring in, hallelujah. Yeah. Some of us need to just launch out, hallelujah. Yes, you've been going through a lot, hallelujah. But your reward is before you, hallelujah. So come on, hallelujah. Yep. Let's say, I hear your voice, Lord. And the stranger voice, I will not listen to, hallelujah. Because you will carry me through. God bless y'all the young people if there's any here. Hallelujah, keep on going, hallelujah. Don't yep. you stop. Seek the Lord. Pray fast and seek the word, hallelujah. God bless. Amen. Amen. Praise it. Praise the Lord. Praise him. It's so weird being up here. <laughs> Get used to this. I would like to greet Bishop Brown, his beautiful wife, my grandfather, Apostle Smith, yeah. um, Mommy, Beverly Smith, um, everyone in their respectful places. It's honestly a blessing to be alive in yeah, a time yeah, like this, yeah. 18 years old. Um, in college right now, I've lost so much people that I've graduated with. That's honestly sad but I'm so grateful to be alive. Yeah. All the young people, um, trust God, and there's nothing you can do without God in your life, because I've been going through so much since quarantine. I started doing the thing inside the booth. I have so much testimonies, but I'm so grateful to be alive. Yeah. 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 Um, I'm gonna sing one verse of a song. I will lift up mine eyes to the hills from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord, the Lord who made heaven and earth. He said, He will not suffer thy foot, thy foot to be moved. The Love. 
Come on, everybody, lift them hands. My hand. Come on, church. My hand. Come on, say My Yeah. All of my coming from the
Can't you feel his presence? Can't you feel his anointing? It's in the room, it's in the room, it's in the room. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Yes, sir. Glory to God. Daniel chapter 3. Let me read from verse 15 to verse 18 for the sake of time. When you have it, say amen. It said, now if you be ready that at that time, at what time you hear the sound of the cornet, flute, harp, sackbut, sorcery, and dulcimer, and all kinds of music, you fall down and worship the image which I have made. Well, but if you worship not, you shall be cast the same hour into the midst of a burning fiery furnace. And who is that God that shall deliver you out of my hands? Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego answered and said to the king, O oh, Nebuchadnezzar, we are not careful to answer thee in this matter, if it be so, our God whom we serve yeah. is able to deliver us from the burning fiery furnace and he will deliver us out of thine hand, okay. But if not, be it known unto thee, okay, that we will not Serve thy gods, nor worship the golden image which thou hast set up. Amen. Just for a few minutes this morning, I want to use for a subject, young people who change the world. Amen. Young people who change the world. Father, we thank you for the word today. We ask you, Lord, that, amen, you have your way in this service. I yield myself as an instrument for your glory. Hallelujah. Use me, O oh God, to bring glory and praise to your name. We cancel every assignment of the enemy this day. Hallelujah. We release the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. In the midst of your people, let more grace. Hallelujah. Come and cover us in the room today. We ask you, oh God, hallelujah, that you would speak. Hallelujah. Make an impact on the lives of those that are here this morning. And Father, hallelujah, we believe that we have received. For we have asked it in the mighty and exalted name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Amen and amen. God bless you. You may be seated in the presence of the Lord. Amen. I thank God this morning for young people. Amen. I looked and I saw our sister April come in and sitting at the drums. And I look at the Swaby boys and amen, sister Dana and some of the other young people, brother Michael, praise God, and some of the other young people here this morning, praise God. And I realized that they are targets of the enemy. The Bible said that the thief come to steal to kill and to destroy. But I am come that they might have life and that they might have it more abundantly. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I realize that, amen, the reason why they are a target of the enemy is because they are gifted. They are talented. Amen. They have a quality, amen, that God has given each of us. The Bible said that all of us have been given a measure of faith. Praise the Lord. And I believe that they are gifts and talents and abilities in the people of God that the devil want to rob us of. Praise God. And we become unproductive. Amen. We, hallelujah, don't use our abilities and talents to serve the house of God. We use our talents and abilities to possibly get rich and 
successful in the eyes of men. Praise God. But I believe, praise God, that, hallelujah, triumphant church need a revival amongst the young people. We need them, praise God, to realize that, hallelujah, if you seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, all other things would be added unto you. It's good to be an engineer, to be a doctor, to be a physician, to be, praise God, hallelujah, amen, uh, any other noble profession, praise God. But I tell you one thing that might be missing from that list is to be a servant in the house of of the Lord. Praise God when you serve God's people and God use you as an instrument and a vessel to make an impact on the lives of individuals to help the hurting and the broken and the wounded of society. Amen. And God uses you to put broken people back together by his power. Amen. You are doing something great in the earth and the devil has made an outward attack on the church and the people of God. Hallelujah. Amen. I got to preach hard sometime because I realized that if the devil had his way, he would empty out the church and leave us. Hallelujah. Praise God. Empty. Hallelujah. Vacant. Praise God. Hallelujah. Useless. Hallelujah. And praise God. Have no impact on the world in which we live in. Praise God. We are surrounded by compromise. Hallelujah. In the house, in the world. Praise God. We live in a time where people have no more standard. They say, I want to be rich. And I don't care who I have to step on. I don't care who I have to lie. Amen too. I don't care how I get it. I got to get it anyhow. But let me tell you something. You might get it, but you might be like Samson. You might get what you want, but you might lose what you have. Praise the Lord. I want to tell you tonight, praise God, that everybody's reaching and trying to get to the top. Praise God. Hallelujah. They don't care who they step on. They don't care. Hallelujah. Who reputation they ruin. Praise God. But I want you to know today, hallelujah, that one thing that is necessary in the church is the power of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Amen. You might have money in the bank. You might have a house on the hill. But if you lose the power of the Holy Ghost in your life, you are an empty shell of what God created you to be. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want you to know, praise God, that these three Hebrew boys, amen, Amen. Were carried as captive into glory to God Babylon. When they got to Babylon, praise the Lord, hallelujah, they saw something in Daniel. They saw something in Shadrach, Meshach, and the Pendigo. And they put them, amen, in the province. And they gave them positions of power. Amen. Because even the devil, can I preach this morning? Even the devil realized how gifted you are. The devil knows how talented you are. The devil looks in you and he see what you're capable of. So he will try to get you to help him build up the kingdom of this world. But it's time, praise God, hallelujah, that if you take a stand for God, the devil's going to get mad. Hallelujah. But I want to say amen to those of you that are gifted and talented. I want you to know that what God gifts you with, you tell the Lord, I want to use Use it to bring glory and praise to your name. Hallelujah. If I have a life left to live, I want God to get the glory. I want God to get the praise. I want God to use me. Hallelujah. To the upbuilding of his kingdom. Glory to God. I look at the two swaby boys and I know the devil wants them and he wants them bad. Hallelujah. But I want to say to the swaby boys, hallelujah, your best bet is to get anointed and let God use you in the church. Hallelujah. Amen. You might not have a lot of money, but if God use you, praise God, you can help to put broken lives back together. Hallelujah. If you can play the saxophone, hallelujah, you need to tell the Lord, use me. Hallelujah. To play 
play. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When David was anointed to play the harp, they tell me when the evil spirit, hallelujah, came on Saul. The Bible said David played his harp. Glory to God and sang his song. Glory to God and the evil spirit that was in Saul, they departed. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When God raised you up, Glory to God, he will use you to touch lives and make an impact for the kingdom. Glory to God, hallelujah. Somebody lift your hand and say, Lord, change my life so I can help change the world. Oh, glory to God, hallelujah. Amen, they overthrow Jerusalem. They broke down the temple. Praise God, and they wanted to break the lives of the people of God. Hallelujah. Amen, Nebuchadnezzar built a statue. He built it, hallelujah, high and he made it out of gold. Glory to God. And he said, I'm going to use the music. Glory to God. Hallelujah. He said, I'll use the coronet. I'll use the flute. I'll use the harp. I'll use the sackbut. I'll use the psaltery and the dulcimer. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want you to know, praise God, that when God put a musical gift in your hand, it's to drive back the forces of evil. It's to let the devil know you can come thus far, but you can't go no further. I want you to play. Glory to God until the spirit of the Lord come down. I want you to give God a praise and let the devil know that you don't have no place in my life. I want to give God the glory. I want to praise him with my hands. I want to praise him with my feet. I want to praise him with my heart. The Bible said let everything that has breath praise the Lord because the devil want to steal the praises. The devil Devil wants you to sing the songs of this world. He wants you to sing R and B. He wants you to sing oldies but goodies. He wants you to get to hip hop. But I want you to know that when you play for Jesus, you on the winning side. For greater is He that is in you than He that is in the world. I want you to play until the Spirit of the Lord come down. Play until you. Feel it in your heart. Play until God drive the devil out of your house. <laughs> Nebuchadnezzar said, When I hear the music, I want you to bow down and worship the image. Glory to God. But the Bible said train up a child in the way that they should go. And when they get old, they will not depart. Sometimes the devil say, let me see what you really made of. Are you going to compromise? Are you going to Hallelujah, do what the devil wants you to do. Or are you going to stand your ground? But I want to say to the young people, be strong, be brave, be courageous. Let the devil know that I'm going to stand for Jesus. Because if you don't stand for something, you'll fall for anything. But I'm going to stand up for what is right. I'm going to stand up for Jesus Christ. I'm going to stand up for holy living. I'm going to stand up for righteousness. I'm going to stand up. Glory to God. And they played the music. And everybody in Babylon bowed down. Oh, great king Nebuchadnezzar. And they bowed down. 
But they looked over their shoulder. They looked down their aisle. They looked in the back of the church. And they said, these boys that you brought from Israel, they refuse to bow down. Glory to God. Everybody else, but they stood firm. They stood on the word. They stood on the promise. Thou shalt have no other gods before thee. Thou shalt worship no other God. There is no God like our God. And if I perish, I perish. Young people like David stood up to Goliath and said, Who is this uncircumcised? Esther stood up and said, If I perish, I perish. Glory to God. Somebody needs to stand up. Somebody to say like Samuel, Speak, Lord. That servant hear it. Be like Isaiah. Who shall I send? And who will go for us? Then said I. Here am I, Lord. Here am I, Lord. Nothing in my hands I bring. But simply... To the cross I cling. Oh, glory to God. My God. They didn't know that when you stand up for God, I said when you stand up for God, God will. Stand up for you. God, my time is almost finished. But I want to borrow Apostle Smith on East 94th or 5th. Where you live? East 94th Street with an electrical cord around his neck glory to God getting ready to kick the chair and die the death of suicide but Jesus stepped in who is that God that shall deliver out of my hand but I thank God Apostle Smith was on death row but the Holy Ghost said not now he gave him another chance and this young man God used him to change the world for when God changed your life you can change your world somebody lift your hand and say Lord change my life so I can change the world Glory to 
glory to God. Apostle Smith, remember, when we got saved, we started preaching, we was broke. Preach, Bishop. I'm talking about poor. We were so poor, we couldn't afford the OR. We were so broke, we couldn't pay attention. But the Bible said, man looking at the outward appearance, but God looks at the heart. When you stand up for God, Nebuchadnezzar said, if you don't bow, we're going to turn up the fire seven times harder. That's just what the devil do. The devil turn up the fire and let me see if you're going to let your outward circumstances dictate what you're going to do and achieve in your life. But they said turn up the fire seven times, 14 times, a hundred times. We're not going to bow down. We're going to stand my ground. We're going to stand up for Jesus. We're going to stand up for the church. We're going to stand up for the kingdom. We're going to stand up. I'm almost finished. When you stand up for Jesus, you thin out the crowd. Because there's a lot of people that said, I'll stand. But when the tough, when the going get tough, the tough get going. But it was them three. But they stood strong. Nudge your neighbor if you're close enough and say, stand strong. Don't let nothing move you. Don't let nothing separate you from the love of God. Stay connected. Paul said, I have fought a good fight. I have finished my course. And I have kept the faith. Glory to God. Sometimes when you stand up for Jesus, sometimes you stand alone. Sometimes you're the only one in your family that's saved. Hold on to Jesus. Because when you stand strong, God will stand up for you. My God, I got to hurry. My God. When you take a stand for Jesus, you're going to face the fire. And the devil going to turn it up. Hallelujah. And the reason the devil turned up the fire, he want to silence true believers. Don't let nobody steal your praise. He want to stop God's people from joining forces together. It's only three of you. But if you stand strong, something unusual is going to happen. My God. Ah. What the devil does in the church, he tries to sow discord among the brethren. He want to divide us. But tell the devil, we refuse to be divided. Yeah. God called us to stand together. My God, I got to hurry. Glory to God. My God. When they stood strong and said, be it so, our God whom we serve is able to deliver us from the fiery furnace. So Nebuchadnezzar said, oh yeah? Let me see what happened when I throw you in the fire. They threw them in the fire. The men that threw them in got burnt. So they just assumed. I got to close. They assumed 
that because their men got burnt, God's people got burnt. But he went back. Ah, can I preach? I said he went back. Y'all don't hear me. I'm playing too much. He said he went back. And he said he looked in the fire. And he said, did not we throw in three. But I see four. And the fourth man. And the fourth man. And the fourth man. He looks like the son of God. God will step in to your fire. When you praise him, he'll step in just when I need him the most. There is a praise that comes out of the fire. Jesus! I said, Jesus! I said, Jesus! Can I close again? There is a fire that the devil don't know about. It's called the fire of the Holy Ghost. When you get in the fire, there is another fire. That is burnt through your praise. I got to close. Fire on fire. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. When you feel like giving up, there is a fire. When you get discouraged, there is a fire. When you feel like quitting, there is a fire. When you feel like turning back, there is a fire. Can you prove it, Bishop? I heard Jeremiah said, I won't preach. I won't make mention of your name. But there is a fire. Shut up in my bones. Fire. That won't let me go. Fire that keeps me burning. a fire that won't go out. There is a fire. Somebody asked Apostle Smith, how can you be online seven days a week? You know how? Fire. That's why I'm here this morning. Fire! That's why I can't give up. Fire!
song that we, I sent you yesterday? What was that song? Yeah. He made a way. Oh, yeah. Come on, church. Let's have a little church right here. I said, He made a way. When my back was against the wall and it looked like it was a death. Yeah, you made a way. And I'm standing here only because you made away. Come on, clap your hands. Give God the glory. I said you made away when my back was against the wall and it looked like it was over. You made away and I'm standing here Only because Praise the Lord. I got to go. How did somebody lift your hand and said, young people, who can change the world? I said, young people, who change the world? Somebody put your hand on your heart and say, Lord, change my life so I can change the world. Lord, use me to change the world. Use my life to make a difference. Use me, Lord. Use me, Lord. Use me, Lord. I got to go. I want to pray for the young people here tonight. You are too gifted. You are too creative. You are too blessed. Hallelujah. Sometimes... When you're in church, you don't realize how blessed you are. Oh. These things, Hallelujah. they treasure, and they forget about oh God. their soul, but I've decided to make Jesus my charm. Sometimes the road gets rough. Then the going gets tough. And the hill, they're so hard to climb. But I started out a long time. And there is no doubt in my mind. For I to make Jesus my child.
Apostle Smith going to help me here. I'm going to say a prayer and I'm going to ask Apostle Smith to come behind me. Would rather finish this prayer off. Young people have houses who change the world. And you are gifted, talented, some folks creative, with abilities that have not yet be, been cultivated. And gold. But God wants you to know that He is on your side. These things be strong. And courageous. And they forget. God is going to stand with you. Their soul. I know. But I have decided. That there's a spirit in the world. Trying to get you to compromise. To make Jesus. But sometimes you got to stand your ground. And tell the devil not so. I've decided. To make Jesus my choice. And I'm going to pray for you tonight. Father right now in the name of Jesus. I didn't even make an altar call. But Father I thank you that you made the altar call for me today. You began to touch hearts. And let people know. That I was born for more than this. I was born with purpose. With a destiny. I was born. To praise the Lord. And I'm here. Because my mother did not abort me. I'm here. Because somehow. I made it. From eternity. Into time. And you have something great. For the Bible said greater is he that is in you. Than he that is in the world. And Father let the power of your Holy Spirit. Fall on the altar of our hearts. Holy Spirit. Descend. As you have done in time past. Oh! Fire of God! Burn! Upon the altars of our heart. God, raise me up to do thy will, O oh God. Use me. To change the world around me. You are gifted. You are talented. You are blessed. You are the seed of God's anointed. And God is going to use you. He's going to use you to do great things in the kingdom. The Bible said, submit yourself therefore unto God. Resist the devil and he shall flee from you. Glory to God. Let your lips be filled with praise. And your mouth be anointed to speak God's word. Let your heart be aflame with the fire of the Holy Spirit and let my life be used as a vessel that will bring glory and honor and praise to the God of heaven. I'm going to turn it over to Apostle Smith. You take it from here. And Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, everyone that stands around this altar this morning, Father, you have some world changers standing here, Father God. In the name of Jesus Christ, I decree and declare over their lives, O oh God, that mighty transformation will wrought in their lives, Father, that they will become God which you have chosen, O oh God, to advance the kingdom in their generation. 
And Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ, I draw that bloodline of protection round about them and unlock their destiny and their purpose this morning. In the name of Jesus Christ, Satan, you cannot have not one of them. In the name of Jesus Christ of the living God, I release this anointing upon them right now to bring transformation and change in their lives. I unlock their giftings in the name of Jesus because they come into time, Lord God, with a purpose and a plan. Oh God, an agenda and a mandate upon their lives to fulfill. And Father God, as we stretch our hands to them this morning, Father, oh God, we ask God that you release this anointing. Let the glory of God fill their soul. Let the fire of God permeate their bodies in the name of Jesus Christ I shift their destiny oh God in the right direction right now in the name of Jesus Christ I claim them for the kingdom of God in the name of Jesus Christ and Lord God as I lay hands on them oh God let the fire of God and the power of the Holy Ghost be released upon them in the name of Jesus Christ Lord touch right now by your power Lord God I rebuke and have pulled down every in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, touch right now by your power, by your grace. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lord God, touch right now. Release that anointing, O oh God. Let their gifting, O oh God, come to permission, O oh God. But if your power and your grace. In the name of Jesus. Come on now, around the altar. Just lift your hand. Just lift your hand and give him a praise. Come on, give him something to work with. Open your mouth and say, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Come on, say, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Something is happening. Something is happening. Right now. Oh, even in your home right now. Even in the hospital, wherever you are right now. Oh, just give him the praise. Let God arise in you. I release you. I release you. In the name of Jesus Christ. I release the greatnesses in you. I release the anointing, the gift of God, the calling of God that is locked up into your spirit. I release it. I unlock it in the name of Jesus Christ. You will be an evangelist. You will be a prophet. You will be an apostle. You will be a bishop. You will be an elder, a minister. You will be one that touch lives, broken lives. I declare and decree over your life today. Your life will not be one of wasteful existence. In the name of Jesus Christ. I want everybody in this sanctuary to clap your hands with them and give God a praise in here. Give God a praise in here. Just fan the flame. Fan the flame. Glory to God. The Spirit of the Lord is here. The glory of God is here. Arise, arise, arise and shine. What you're feeling right now is a touch of God. Is a touch from glory. Is a touch from heaven. He's here right now. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. He's breaking every chain. He's breaking every shock. Your mistake does not disqualify you. Come on. I know the devil tell you did something wrong. Your mistake does not disqualify qualify you. Just give him the praise right now. I dare you to open your mouth. I dare you to clap your hands even in your home and cry glory to God. He deliver your miracle and the wings of praise. He deliver the anointing and the rings of praise. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Somebody's getting a touch right now. Somebody's breaking through right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. What you're feeling right now is not your emotion. It's a touch from God. The same spirit that raised Jesus from the dead is manifesting himself. Come on, manifest, 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 manifest in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we bless your name. Lord, we glorify your name. Oh, God, we thank you for the world changers. We thank you, Lord, for those of the gift of God in them. Just like you call Jeremiah, who told Raman de Boshata before they were formed in the mother's womb, God. You have chosen them. You have ordained and sanctified them and set them apart for yourself. Use them, God. Use them, God. Even as they grow up, Lord God, let them to grow in the fear of God. To grow, Lord God, with a desire for God to use them in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, we thank you now. We thank you now. Somebody clap your hands with them and give God a praise for them right now. Oh my God. My God, something is happening. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Something just broke. My God. My God. Young people, you stay strong. Glory to God. And you desire for God to use you. 
and he will use you because you desire amen when his godly god will meet your need and the bible said delight yourself in the lord and he will give you the desires of your heart come on you world changers clap your hands come on you world changers my god god bless you god bless you God bless you. God bless you. Well, somebody ought to give the Lord a praise for that mighty word today. What an awesome word. Praise God. My God. My God. Foot. Amen. The second weekend of our revival. And next weekend again. Amen. Friday and Sunday morning. My God. What a mighty God we serve. How many receive that word from the Lord today? My God. You are a world changer. It don't matter who you are. My God. What a mighty God we serve. He is the footman in your fire. My, my, my. How many glad he come walking into your fire? My God, didn't we throw three men in there? But I see four and the footman look like the son of God. Where did he see the son of God? He's a heathen. My God. But the footman, he said he looked like the son of God. When Jesus, when Peter said, Thou art the Christ, the son of the living God. Jesus said, flesh and blood didn't give you that one. But it comes straight from my Father which is in heaven. And God opened the heathen man eye. Let him know. Amen. That you mess with the wrong set of people. You mess with them. I show up before time. I give them an unscheduled breakthrough. I let you confess who I am before I go to the cross. I wish if I have somebody in here. Somebody need to give the Lord a praise. He never leaves you. One thing with God. He's not restricted by time. Glory to God. There's no limit on him. He show up anytime, any place, anywhere. And let the devil know I'm still God. Amen. I'm grateful today. If you seek old Amanda Yasata. My God, I feel I tell you, my God, I almost said God live in my house. I think I was at home. Glory to God. My God. I tell you, I tell you, if you're sick in your body today, amen. We know we have, we have just five more minutes, but you're sick in your body today. Amen. Healing is the children's bread. Healing is not a promise. Amen. You remember that. Healing is not a promise. It's an established fact. It's a part of your portion. Is a part of your inheritance. Amen. So don't believe healing is a promise. Hey, he's going to heal me. I already heal. All you've got to do is accept it. Receive it. Believe it. And it will manifest. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I declare and decree over your life today. Amen. That this season. Your season for divine delivery. Get ready for God to deliver you from every bondage. Every oppression. Every sickness. Every disease. Because he's that kind of God. It's your time. I prophesy to you this morning that your delivery will manifest in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. It cannot be stopped. Amen. It cannot be stopped. It might be delayed, but it, you will not be denied. Because if God delivers you, no devil can stop it. Somebody lift your hand and say, I'm delivered. Oh my God. I feel something released just now. I am delivered. I'm not waiting to be delivered. I am delivered. Glory to God. And I thank God today. I thank God today. My God. My God. Thank God for the man of God today. Stretch your hand towards the bishop. Amen. Let us pray and declare a word over his life. My God, my God, my God, my God. Ooh, Jesus, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Thank you for the vessel that you used, O oh God. God, I pray today that you continue to bless and anoint him. To use him, Lord God, and to set his spirit on fire. Continually let that fire burn. Lord God, that even as we speak the word of God into the people of God, their spirit will capture the revelation. And the fire of God in them will rekindle through the spoken word. Because fire beget fire. Father, touch them today. I thank you for this man of God and his wife and family. Preserve and keep them in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Meet every need in their lives, Father. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And Lord, I thank you. And I give you the praise, the glory, and the honor right now in Jesus' name. Somebody say amen. Say it again. One more time. Amen. God bless you. We're going to cut it our tithes and our offering. Thank God again for Pastor Roberts who is with us this morning. Grace and peace be unto man of God. Let's do it quickly now. Amen. In Jesus' name. My God. What a powerful song that you gained a song this morning. How many received that song? He made a way. <laughs> Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. All of my help cometh from the Lord. 
My God, we're gonna somebody text me and say, My husband is crying like a baby. Glory to God. How broken under that song. My help cometh from the Lord. Oh my God. I'm gonna ask everyone today to be a blessing. Amen. In this offering. Amen. And God will bless you. Your tithes and your offering. Amen. Your offering belongs to the Lord, and tithe is something that God requires from us. Amen. And remember this, the seed that leaves your life, your hand will never leave your life. It will never leave your life. It goes into your future and bring back an harvest. So you sow in God's work and God bless you. My God, please all stand. Please, if you're a visitor and you'll be a blessing to this ministry, God bless you. Amen. If you're making out a check, make it a triumphant church of Jesus Christ. Amen. In Jesus' name. Praise God. Remember on Tuesday night, Bible study, 6.30. Amen. On Zoom. Amen. Friday night, deliverance service. One night of revival. Sunday morning, revival continue right here. Amen. Divine intervention. Glory to God. And this evening, 7.30. Amen. And Zoom. With the men's department combined from Jamaica, Florida, everywhere. Amen. And I'll be preaching for them. In Jesus' name. All right, we're going to ask you to come with your offering. Come quickly, please. And remember, every day, 12 o'clock, Bishop Bonnie Brown, amen, sharing the word, midday manna. You be in the midday manna. And Saturday, every Saturday, the hour of prayer, my God, from 12 to 1, amen. And every Wednesday night and Thursday night, where the eagles gather, the gathering of eagles, my God, right there in Zoom, Amen. Same Zoom number every Wednesday night and Thursday night. Amen. You can just watch the, amen, go online and you'll see, amen, Facebook, you see the, amen, the Zoom number. So many people have it. You just ask anybody. Amen. They're calling from everywhere. What a mighty God. Thank you for coming. Thank you for coming with your offering. Amen. God bless you. Glory to God and heaven smile upon you. My God, my God. Go ahead, Brother Terry. fancy mics that we have nowadays beyond me. Praise God. Amen. Let's look to God. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you right now, Lord. We thank you for the offering that was brought forth. We thank you for the gift. 
and we thank you for the gift. We ask you to bless those, amen, that even though they had in mind to give, they didn't have the money this time around. We ask you to bless them that the next time around, that they might have something to give to your service. We pray, oh God, that you protect us as we leave from your house. Father God, on the highways and byways to go back to our several destinations. Be with us and guide us. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen and amen. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Come on. All over the church, just clap your hands and give the Lord another praise. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we thank you, Lord God, for this glorious day. We thank you for the fellowship, the worship, the song, the giving of offerings. God, we thank you for the word. Ah, oh, my God. Thank you for the vessels that you have used, oh God, to bless your people, to pour into our lives. Father, we ask this week that you cover us under the blood of Jesus Christ. Those who travel and those who plan to travel and will be traveling, we draw the bloodline of protection around them. Father God, cover them under your blood. Keep them from the virus. Keep them from the plague. Father God, in the name of Jesus, let there be no premature death, no accident. We cancel every plan of the enemy, every satanic conspiracy, every diabolical counsel. Lord God, we rebuke and cancel and delete it out in the name of Jesus Christ. And I declare this week will be a blessing of uncommon favor upon the people of God. God, position people in the right place, God, to be a blessing to your people. Give them promotions they are not qualified for. Give them raise, God, that they are not qualified for. Keep them healthy, strong, and mighty. Oh, Rama, my God, in the name of Jesus Christ. And Lord, I thank you, and I call it done right now in Jesus' name. Let somebody say amen. Say it again. One more time. Let the words of my mouth, the meditation of my heart, be acceptable in thy sight. O oh Lord, my strength and my redeemer. God bless you. Grace and peace be unto you. Amen. Give somebody a bump before you go. In Jesus' name. He made a way for me. 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 He made a way, come on, say, He made a way for me. He made a way. 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 